do yeah. is adore you all of the time. I like to. Bye -bye. Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention? I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. And I need all of you to stop what you're doing and listen. You too, what is going on? What is it, 825 in the morning? I just got to the shop. You see I still got my backpack on and everything, so. Shout out to the Falcons, you already know what it is. I'm gonna, I know this hat look crazy, but uh, I'm gonna keep this hat for forever. It was the first inaugural season for the Atlanta Falcons that the Mercedes Benz on, so uh, it is what it is. Yeah, we took an L in the Super Bowl, but so what? So, but anyway, um, leave a like if you enjoy this content, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you uh, subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment down below, please, because I love to get that feedback. I love to get uh, what you guys think about everything. My setup, uh, my camera angles, my fading ability, my haircut ability, whatever you want to call it. Oh, last but not least, don't forget to hit that bell so you can be notified every time your boy uh, upload a video. Let's get into it. Okay, YouTube, so I start out with my number two uh, guard and this uh, magnetic guard on my Asa Fast feed and I have the lever all the way closed and I'm going to take that line up um, he kind of wanted on this haircut like a um, like I said a Donovan Mitchell style a Donovan Mitchell style uh, taper on the uh, a temp fade high temp fade whatever you want to call it on the side so I take that up to kind of like the uh, I guess the the, the top of the uh, the crown area not the crown the uh I can't think of the name right now, but you guys get the point. I took it up to the to the highest point with my number two because I'm going to blend into that number two for during the, uh, the duration of the taper. Also, when I'm um, when I'm fading, I sometimes like to fade down. Um, I don't know if you guys know it, but fading down helps the blend just become just beautiful and it looks amazing when you fade down so if you can when you fade up go back down with the same guard just close the lever and it's going to look amazing <clears throat> so right here i take my number one guard and i go to the arch and that's how i start my fade i take my number one and i close the blade all the way and then uh, that's how i make my first line my second my second guideline I just take it halfway with that same number one guard and then I open it all the way up and blend it into that number two and then I take the number one guard and I open it up and turn it around and I go down on the hair to make sure that the hairs are laid down and, and it makes the blend just come together so much more easy excuse me so much more easier so I'm gonna try to fast forward through it well, maybe, maybe I won't I'll just let the process uh, play itself out I'll just uh, try to fast forward through it parts that I can. Right here, I take my Andy's XL with the, uh, the five zero blade on it and I just scoop at that art, like I scoop at the art because it's way easier to take a line out that you don't permanently put in there like it's a lineup, just for beginner's sake, you know what I'm saying? So I take that and I scoop it out and I create my first dial on. The next thing I do is I get my Oster Fast Free and I open the lever all the way open and I make my second guideline. So after that, I move my lever halfway, and I also move my lever close to massage that line, that triple zero line out during that process. It's very easy, very simple, and that's why you scoop at the lines with the triple, uh, the, the triple, the five zero, so that it can make the process a lot easier. And right here, I continue that same process. I put my zero guard on, I uh, open the lever, and I massage that line into that number one. Then I go halfway, and then I go close for the bottom portion of that line. And you just keep massaging. Make sure you to not push the line up at all because you started with a number two. 
So you should be fine to fade into, uh, to, to put that zero guard up and open it up and keep flipping up the line, flipping up the line. So right here, I started on my line. And like I said, um, if you watch my other video, I don't have a process. Sometimes I start left side. Sometimes I start in the middle. Sometimes I start on the right side. But in this situation, I started on the left side. Of, uh, I started on the left side of my client's head. And uh, and I worked my way to the middle. But the end result is ultimately what we are looking for. And that's a, just a crispy lineup. So right here on this side, I do the exact same thing I did to the the other side. I start with the two, I go to the, uh, I start with the two, then I go to the one, then I go to the zero, and then I go to the open, and I go to the close, and, and I massage it out in the middle. But the process is the same, you guys, on both sides, so don't make it harder than it has to be. You know, I start with the number two so that I can, I can give myself room to make mistakes so I'm going to speed it up from this process and we're going to see what the end result looks like. And hopefully it turns out good. Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention? I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. And I need all of you to stop what you're doing and listen. So again, like I told you guys, I don't have a process to my um, to my lineup. Sometimes I go left side, right side, middle. It just depends on how I feel. So right here, I'm just gonna start. I already did the uh, the right side, starting to do the left side, and then I think I'm gonna put a little uh, color enhancement, a little topic in there. I put the curl sponge on the top, and then we're gonna you know send him out to do his thing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like um, if you did enjoy. It. Uh, please hit that subscribe button and leave a comment down below, please, because I would love to get you guys' feedback. Stings the nostrils in a good way. Yeah. Brian, I'm going to be honest with you. That smells like pure gasoline. 60% of the time, it works every time. That doesn't make sense. Okay, so YouTube, this is what we're working with. This is the final product, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, hit that bell, and leave a comment down below. You're watching A Barber's Life, and I am Tabaris Bell, aka Tap the Barber.